Hello. Imagine, if you will, you're laying in bed at night and all of a sudden you hear these creepy crawly steps that are going through the above you. Or you kind of feel the crawling going around or you hear it around you when you sleep. It could be that you are infested with mice and you got to deal with the problem. So what do you do? Well, you set mouse traps. Today, I'm going to show you how to properly set a mouse trap. Now there's a couple of steps involved in doing this, but primarily what we're looking for is the step that helps people take care of the mice problem. I have grown up in, the, in agriculture around farms, and I know that mice are a problem, especially when it comes to dealing with livestock feed and getting into other food sources. Today I'm going to show you the steps what mouse traps to use, the proper methods to bait, and then how to deal with mice once you catch them. Okay, so what do we use to begin? Well, the Victor Corporation recommends using their trap. They're one of the world's leading authorities on mouse traps. They've been building mouse traps for a number of years, and this is the best trap to use according to their research. Um, the Victor Corporation also says that for bait, it is best to use something sweet and sticky. So we're going to go with peanut butter, as recommended by the Victor Corporation. So what you do is you get a little bit of peanut butter on your knife, and you place it on the bait pedal located right here on the mousetrap. Just a little bit of butter right there to kind of entice any mice that happen to be coming your way. So now comes the hard part. Now you have to set the mouse trap, and what you do is you take the trap lever and you pull it back really, really slow and tight to make sure that you have proper lever action, and you mount it with this mounting lever and lock it in place on the trap itself, just like that. Now the trap is effectively baited. Pestcontrol.com says that the best thing to do when it comes to mounting a trap is to place it up against a wall or other surface where mice happen to be traveling. So when you place your trap, put it up against the wall or in an enclosed surface. And so when that mouse comes around and it looks at the kind of bait that's there and is enticed, the next thing you know, you will have taken care of that mouse. And then once the trap has gone off, you take the mouse you take it over a piece of garbage, you dispose of the mouse, clean the trap, and wash your hands to ensure proper cleanage. And then you can set the trap again. These traps are useful for homes, in barns, offices, or any structure that has a mouse infestation. So the next time you are dealing with mice infestations yourself, remember this lesson and set your mouse traps in the appropriate manner.